Twitchimo Studio presents Explore Space. This is work in process number three for Relusion Animation at Work 2022 contest. We'll be using Cartoon Animator and the free software Pixel Part and Criter to simulate space flight. First, start up Pixel Part. At the top left, hit File. Down to Open Examples nature and electric it's always best to save your project with save as many times i overwrote the example files and had to uninstall the program and then reinstall it to get those examples back so i'm going to save the new creation as space flight hd3 here you can see there are three different layers if you right click on each layer we can see how each layer affects the animation. The layer center controls the white ball in the middle. Turning off layer named dummy does not seem to affect anything. Notice the arrow. Clicking on it reveals a sublayer called rail. When we turn that layer off, the animation stops. So let's remove the center layer. Remove the force layer. Select the dummy layer. Select the motion tab. And we will adjust the initial velocity. Adjust it to 10. Let's try 15. Okay, 20. I like that. Let's move to the trail layer. Under general, change the shape to circle. Now we have to render the image. Select the render icon at the top. It looks like a camera. So the standard resolution is 512 by 512 pixels. Because the video from Cartoon Animator is output in HD, I want my images to be 500 by 282, which will correspond to HD format, but smaller. Now hit the render icon. Notice it renders 87 frames. That bogs down Cartoon Animator. Let's reduce the duration of the animation. Let's try, two. Hit render again. That's still 60. How about 1.5? After rendering again, we get 45, I can live with that. Now to export. Under type select, image sequence. File format, you'll want PNG. Then select your file path. Right click in the open area of the export window, you can create a new directory, and name it.
open the new directory. Now name your PNG files, and then hit save. Now hit export. Open your folder and you should see 45 PNG images. Open Cartoon Animator. Drag the first image from File Explorer, and drop it in the stage area. Hit Prop. Switch over to Composer Mode. Hit the PSD icon to open Criter, and hit Launch. The PSD file created will have the needed format you will need. Hit File, Save As, save it near the images. I'm using the name, sflight.psd. Close down Cartoon Animator. Don't save anything yet. Back to Criter. In File Explorer, right click on the first image, then, down to open with, select Criter. A new image tab, will appear. Back in File Explorer, select 50 to 54. I renumbered my images from 10 to 54, your will be 0 to 43. Grab the files, and drop them on top of the work area, and hit insert many layers. Remove the background layer, so it loads in the layers, but if you notice they are not in order. I have not found any PSD editor, that will reorder automatically. You need the numbers to be in descending order, from top to bottom, or your animation will run backwards. Reorder the layers, 50 at the top, and then in order to 54 below, select the top layer, then select another 10, doing the same operation, then reordering the layers. When you add the next group, make sure you select the top layer before dropping the next batch. If you dump the whole lot of images at once, it is very difficult, to reorder all the layers. If anyone knows, of a script for Kryter to sort layers, please put it in the description.
Save your work. Save it as a PST file. Select all layers. Right click and select group. And create a quick group. Now go to the PSD file created by Cartoon Animator. Copy the RL pivot. Open the second PSD image. Make sure the group is closed, hit edit and paste. Back to the first image, and select, RL image. Copy it, and paste it, into the second image. The two subfolders must have the same file name. Take our new group, and drop it over RL image, so that it becomes its subfolder. Now delete this folder. Rename the group's folder to S-Flight. If you notice, that the two pivot points are off-center, select each layer and move it to the middle, using the Move tool. Just going to save it, with a new name. Now, exit Kryter. Open up Cartoon Animator. Hit Prop, then Custom. Twitch Imo Studio, and Explore Space. In Stage Mode, take our new PSD file, drag and drop it, into the stage area. It automatically switches over to Composer Mode, just switch back. Let's expand the prop. Select the sprite editor. Here, you can see all the images. Bring up the timeline. Then motion. You will see, that the first keyframe, corresponds to the first image. What you have to do next, is to advance a frame, 
at a time, and change, to the next image. Use the right arrow, on your keyboard, to advance, a frame at a time. Select the Collect Clip tab. Select the first frame, press the left mouse button and drag your pointer to the last keyframe. Now, right click and select Add to Action menu. Name your action. I've selected Space Flight. Select OK, and close the Sprite Editor. Now to save, your new animated prop. Reselect the image and hit the plus icon. Name the new animated prop. Let's test it. Open a new project. Drag and drop the new prop onto the stage. Open time line. Right click and hit action menu, then space flight. Open the Motion tab. Here we can see the action. Let's drag it, a number of times, to increase the length, to about 222 keyframes. Open Project Settings, and change the frames to 222. Select, Repeat, and hit Play. Thank you for joining my journey of animation.